Hello everybody, this is 33 Readings and this reading is going to be for Leo. Leo, let's see where are the messages for you for the month of May. Make sure that you check your signs for Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. And then proceed with the reading. Also know that the energies I speak about are completely interchangeable. This one's for Leo. Also going to be picking out Oracle card messages for you, Leo. So stick around till the end for those. Okay. Let's see, Leo. What are the messages for you? What messages do you have for Leo? What messages do you have for Leo? For the month of May. Ooh, you get a lot of cards. The moon in the reverse. Oh, so you could be dealing with a Pisces. You could be dealing with a Cancer or Earth sign. This to me is giving me a sense of direction. So there's a sense of direction here. Like something's going to pick up pace. Um, somebody who might have not told you about things between the two of you is going to be coming back and they're going to boss up basically. Because you maybe stepped out and now they want to come back. So that this, these three cards are giving me those vibes. We will see. Okay. Eight of Swords. Hangman. You're not feeling the very best. Why is that Eight of Swords here? Confusion. Okay. What's the overall? Alright. So the Ace of Swords for... I feel like what you appreciate the most in relationships and what you appreciate the most to continue doing things with somebody is the honesty and overall energy is that ace of swords so that is talking to me about reconciliation and remember the moon was in reverse so I feel like somebody is going to be coming back to talk things out with you okay like let's have a conversation and let's let's fix this that's the energy that I'm getting um so you have been very emotional it's been a roller coaster ride for you leo and this person always confused you uh, right they weren't telling you where this is going so that could be the reason why you felt stuck and stagnant you felt like things weren't moving forward between the two of you leo especially with that hangman that i see whoa that is talking to me about stuck and stagnant situation a lot of confusion somebody closed off to another person completely why am i getting this vibe that this was you leo that you decided to not get involved with anybody who's not emotionally available Yeah, you you walked away. You you gave up. You gave up on somebody. Because there wasn't enough effort, there wasn't enough love that was being reciprocated. Your person right now is the ace of cups. They want to come back. They do. Wow, this to me seems like a whole new beginning as well, Leo. Could be somebody new as well which who or, you know somebody who's going to be coming in to confess if you have options of course if you don't a hundred percent this is somebody coming back to talk it out with you and this is going to lead to a lot of emotional fulfillment so wow this is good this is good let's see um you're coming out of this energy of taking the stress because you took enough stress already 
and now you don't want to sabotage it for yourself basically so you're coming out of this anxious energy you don't even want to dwell on anything that's not positive or just something that helps you move forward in life so that's the reason why you gave up because there was a lot of confusion no sense of direction and you cannot tolerate that and there was lack of honesty as well let's see Queen of Wands, so you have somebody wanting to pursue you. Maybe possibly this person want, wants to talk. This person wants to pursue you, Leo, 100%. You see that Queen of Wands, that's their energy. That's somebody coming towards you with a love offer, with, with like, hey, we can work this out. See how this queen has a sunflower in her hand. So that to me is talking about, let's work it out. You've lost hope in this because you gave in your all and now you've lost hope in this. You don't even want to, you have lost hope in this Leo. I feel like by you giving up, this person realizing that you might have given up. So is it time for them to step up? You walked away from a situation that wasn't fulfilling you. There was lack of honesty, like maybe you even asked this person, hey, where is this going? And they didn't confess or they didn't tell. What's the outcome? Then we're going to clarify more for you. What's going to be the outcome? Page of Wands, isn't that communication? Now, don't tell me there are so many communication cards here. There's definitely um, reconciliation. Okay, definitely. But you've lost the, the thing the problem here is that you have lost hope in this so i don't know if you want to deal with this person or not do you see that you see them as a sneaky person somebody who lies to you so you're holding back you some of you are keeping your options open and you're you're completely giving up on this what's um what to expect in may for leo please one card now this card is going to be overall not just your love life one card for leo for overall Ten of Swords. Bottom is the Fool. That's Fool is talking to me more. But do you see how these two cards are correlating? This is an ending, and this is a new beginning. You're trying to free yourself from anything that burdens you. Some of you are really open to new beginnings as well. That's nice. Oopsie. Let's see. I did see the ten of ones again. Let's see how's your person coming towards you, Leo. What is the energy for specific person for Leo? What is their energy? What is their energy? Let's give it a shuffle. What is their energy? What is their energy? Let's give it three shuffles. What is their energy? Last one. Oh, there's a card. Seven of Cups. They think that you have left. And they're not happy about it. Leo. Your person's not happy mourning. Do you see how that card says that? Ooh, they're not happy. They're overthinking about you. And for some of you, this person was keeping things quite up in the air. Like it wasn't, there was, there was lack of direction, like I was saying. So you were confused as hell in this connection with this person. Five of Cups is you. You're not happy either. They think that you've walked away from them. They know it, that you've walked away from them. Let's see. So 
so you do, okay you see them as somebody who doesn't who doesn't express much and you're not about it um some of you could be dealing with a virgo um pisces cancer scorpio any sign though but i'm just telling you the signs are here of uh air signs here to libra gemini aquarius but you see this person as a player or somebody who doesn't express a lot you see them as somebody who's very slow and cautious and somebody just who doesn't express a lot they're coming towards you with that six of pentacles energy so they're coming in to work it out with you okay they're gonna they're gonna talk six of pentacles see page of pentacles and that so to me this is talking about This is definitely communication and for some of you this could also be a financial gain. Uh, well, this to me actually is about communication from this person. What is the overall energy for the month of May for Leo please? What is the overall energy? What overall energy? What is the overall energy? Queen of Cups emotions three of swords at the bottom of this one so heartbreak somebody broke your heart maybe there was a third party situation that you got to know about but leo hey you've lost hope you're not working on this with them you're trying to find your balance by yourself because there wasn't enough to offer from their side and now they're coming back they want to work it out with you and they're well aware of the fact that you're not giving in to this what messages do you have for Leo? What messages? Trust. The situation is calling for you to have faith. Heart to heart conversation. See, honestly, discuss your feelings with each other. Forgiving and learning. Pay attention to the red flags. Leo, as you release the past, you experience more love in your present moments and the signs are cautioning you. You already know what's up. I know that. There's somebody coming back. They're going to ask for you to trust them. Heart to heart conversation. That's somebody really coming back to talk it out with you. Release resentments. patience they will talk to you soon see no more complaining which is good emotional healing is required I kind of want to see one more let me see okay perfect timing so those are your notes have faith in the process this is the third time i saw this they will talk and the decision is going to be yours leo okay so those were the messages for you i hope you enjoyed this reading if you did make sure you subscribe to my channel and like the video you can subscribe to my other channel 33 intuitive for bonus readings um when you subscribe to my channel please press the bell icon as well so whenever i upload you're notified thank you so much for being here take care and bye bye